Hey guys and girls of YouTube, I'm going to show you tonight how to make uh, some cheap tortilla chips. You know, you buy a bag, you know, I don't know how big they are, for like a $3.99 or $2.99 or whatever they cost. Uh, and you don't get that many because the bag is half full of that nitrogen air because they got to put it in there, you know, to, to keep it fresh, you know. So uh, what I've got here is a, a 30 pack of corn tortillas. So what we're going to do tonight, I'm going to cook up a few of these in my uh, cast iron pan. Alright, this pack here cost about, 30 of these cost about a dollar. A dollar and a quarter maybe. And uh, you can make hundreds of uh, tortillas out of them. Tortilla chips. Just get you a, a pizza cutter. If you want to make them big, like that, you get four. If you make, if you want to make them smaller, cut them like a pizza. So right there, we got uh, there's six and there's four. So uh, what we're going to do? I've got some oil heated up right there. You can see. We're going to start throwing some of these uh, corn tortillas in there. Should be a short video. Nothing much to it. They get crowded, just move them around. Ooh, watch out for that. Oh, it's hot. Yeah, just like that. Now, over here, I've already got some. Uh, Hamburger mixed up with some taco mix, you know, just Taco Bell or whatever you want to get, you know, just cook you a pound of hamburger meat. Throw in the sauce or the, the powder, and there you go. It's pretty good. This guy here, these guys here, don't, they don't take very long. Give them a little wiggle around that uh, cast iron pan there. I've got some tomatoes chopped up. A little lettuce. I got some shredded cheese. <clears throat> We're just making a, a tortilla taco mix, I guess. If you want to call it that. I'm just stirring the hamburger meat over here with the taco mix in it. You want to see, uh, when these guys start flipping up on the edges and start getting bubbles in them, in about a minute or so, they're going to be ready to flip. So there's no sense you guys having to wait around for that. So hang on. Alright guys. Uh, they're turning up on their edges. And I can see that they're starting to get a little brown around the corners. So what I'm going to do now is start flipping them over. And get them brown on that side too. Some of them are a little browner than others. It'll be alright. They're still going to taste the same. Alright. Now I've got some garlic powder. Right now is a good time to go ahead and dust them. You can use any uh, spice you want right now. If you do it right now, it'll it seems like it, it sticks to the to the chip better than if you take it out because it's still uh, oily, wet. So I'm going to cook those up for another couple of minutes. And I'll probably do another batch. And uh, our hamburger meat still going over there with the uh, taco mix in it. So I'll do this batch of one more and then uh, we'll be back. Alrighty guys. Here is four of those small tortilla chips, the corn chips. And uh, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to lay them around. I've got a uh, lemon on this plate. I've got uh, some uh, sour cream laid out in the center there. You can see that. Now I did the same thing with the second batch as I did the first. All I did was fry them and uh, put some uh, garlic powder on them. Yeah, that's all of them. Let's go ahead and... Uh, let me find me a handle of this skillet. Hang on one second. Let's see. There you go. Hang on one second, guys. 
All right, now off camera, while these the second batch was cooking, I added some uh, sharp uh, uh, shredded cheddar cheese to that uh, hamburger meat and taco sauce or taco mix or whatever. So what I'm going to do now is just put some of this all around. Ooh, look at that cheese. The edges here, just like that. Just kind of spread it around. Yeah, this is not very healthy. If you're if you come here for health food, you might as well go ahead and exit the video now. Mm. But mainly, this video is about the homemade uh, tortilla chips. You don't have to spend a lot of money to get those. I mean, like I said, that little bag of thirty cost about a dollar, or maybe a dollar and a quarter. And it comes with 30 of them, and this is just four out of the 30. Let's get all that in there. Let's move that out of the way. Now I've got some, uh, you guys seeing that? Yeah. I've got some tomato over here that I've got uh, chopped up. You guys see that? That's looking good. With a bunch of U's. Let's go ahead and get them. Get them all in there. Just like that. And I've got some lettuce I've got chopped up. All around the edges. Just like I, just like I so. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's get them a little, just a little bit more maybe. Looks good. And my hands washed off, guys. I'll be right back. Alrighty. Now, I don't know if this will be called a, a taco salad or what. But, we're going to dig into it. Let's get one of these chips. Oh, goodness. You see that? You can't see that. There you can. Or now you can, anyway. It's cheese stringing off of it. Let's dip it down that sour cream. I want you guys to hear the, the crispiness of this of this chip that we just cooked. Hang on. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. There's no reason to go out and buy a three or four dollar bag of tortilla chips when you don't get half a bag full. You can go buy these guys here, 30 count for a dollar. I'll take one more test and I'll leave you guys alone. See that, guys? Just dip it in that sour cream. Oh, there's so much hanging off. Let's get that off there. Alright, anyway guys, thanks for watching. Hope it wasn't too boring. And maybe you learned something, I don't know. Homemade tortilla chips are very easy and very good. Good. Thanks for watching everybody. Bye.